Well, you're probably the most experienced mm. player in the Real Madrid team. How did you feel when Jose Mourinho asked you to come to play for the world's biggest club? Yeah, thank you. It's true. I'm uh, the oldest. And um, of course, when um, I knew uh, the club was interested in me, it was, was exciting. It was a big step for me. Uh, I spent six years in, um, in um, Chelsea. It was, was perfect. And after that, to, to come to the big, big club, biggest club in the world was fantastic. And uh, uh, I'm so proud to, to be here and to play for, for, for Madrid. Well, you've travelled a long journey with, with Jose Mourinho, starting in Porto, then of course in England, and now at Real Madrid. How has he helped you as a player? You know, every he goes always uh, for a detail. He works works every day well, and um, he wants to you to improve every day. And so it's normal to you with the, every day you start to to grow as as a player, as as a man as well. And uh, I'm very proud. Of it. I, had, uh, I I worked with him for for a long time, and uh, and uh, it's special to 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 be with him. Well, what is the secret to his to Jose Mourinho's success? Do you think? No, every day uh, he wants always uh, to do well, to work, to improve every day. And he goes to the tail, he don't, he don't afford to, to, to make mistakes. He said, no, you can't make mistakes, you have to be all the time focused on your game and your training to, to be better. So, because that, have every player is with him. If they're training well, if they listen, they, we, can, we, can, we can improve. The Santiago Bernabeu, as we all know, is a huge stadium. What, what's the atmosphere like? At the Santiago Bernabeu on a say a big Champions League night, compared to other stadia that you've played at around the world, it's different. It's different. Um, it's the feeling. It's difficult to, to explain. It's the feeling when you arrive and you see the, the stadium. The, no, the, all persons, all people are around you. Uh, the stadium is so big. You feel like it's, 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 it's a big, it's the biggest club on, on, in the world, and um, when you go, you want go in. You have to just to do your best, try to do your best, uh, and the people and the people enjoy it because they, they like they like they like to enjoy and to see good football. But what player has really stood out for you? We'll say over the past few months in Sorry? the team. What player looks good to you over the past few months in particular? In particular. Yeah. I don't need to, see, to, to say names, yeah. of course, everyone will speak <laughs> about, more about this or that. But as a team, you are, you are compact. You, are, you want to grow as a team as well. And for that, you have to, to win our match. Yeah. And we are doing uh, that. So you want to improve, to grow as a team and to, to get trophies. This is more important, of course. Uh, it's normal. Sometimes they speak more uh, about Ronaldo, Pipe, Guain, Benzema, Be uh, up front, uh, Di Maria, uh, Marcelo. Ma but uh, more important is, is, is to grow and to, to, to grow as a team and, uh, and uh, win our games and try to, to do our best and to play well. Well, after, of course, Chelsea, you moved here to Real Madrid and it's one of the youngest clubs in Europe. What advice do you give to the younger players coming through? No, I don't know. The youngest, of course, you've got young players here than, than in Chelsea. I'm the, the, the oldest one. Uh, but um, the youngest players here, they, they got so talent. So they have just to, 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 to wait and to have... Um, to Give a time because they, they, they can they can do it very well. 